The president has asked me to convey to you that he's sending his energy bill to the floor with a call for a 10% reduction. The president's expecting our full support. Yes, he is. The Sydney. president's dreaming, AJ. The president Sydney has critically misjudged reality. If he honestly thinks that the environmental community is going to whistle a happy tune while rallying support around this pitifully lame mockery of environmental leadership, then your boss is the chief executive of Fantasyland. Good morning, Mr. President. How are you today? I couldn't be better. My apologies for the interruption. Mr. President, I don't know what to say. I'm speechless. All evidence to the contrary. What would happen if I called Sydney Wade and asked her to be my date at the state dinner on Thursday evening? <sighs> the president can't just go out on a date. I'm having dinner at the White House. I'm having lunch at the Kremlin. I don't know what happened. One minute I was calling him a mockery of an environmental leader. The next minute I had a date. She didn't say anything about me. Well, no, sir, but I can pass her a note before study hall. Would you like to dance? Yeah, I guess. I mean, yes, sir. I'd love to. Never mind that she is the hired gun of an ultra-liberal political action committee. And never mind that his 12-year-old daughter is sleeping down the hall. Lucy, are you okay with this? Am I having dinner with a lady? Dad, it's cool. Just go for it. and I'm running for president. In the past seven weeks, 59% of the country has begun to question your family values. This poll doesn't talk about my presidency. This poll talks about my life. I, I gotta nip this in the bud. This has catastrophe written all over it. Sydney, the man is the leader of the free world. He's brilliant. He's funny. He's an above average dancer. Isn't it possible our standards are just a tad high? Do you think there'll ever be a time when you can stand in a room with me and not think of me as the president?